Anaconda highlights. This was the fourth practice session out of six for the weekend. And happy to say that this one went green flag from start to finish. One hour of final practice and a lot of talk about this session finishing with some boost mobile qualifying simulations to get a bit of an idea as to who's got the grip. Thomas Randall, he was struggling for grip at the bottom of the chase down there with both those front tyres locked up and squealing for mercy. Chaz Mostert back in pit lane. I did hear that this team were discussing some little radio issues that they were chasing throughout the course of the session. That also happened to car 888 as well. Sam Scafidi had a birthday at the track yesterday, chatting with the team. There were the opportunity to put both the co-driver and the main game driver into the car. Ripper effort from Matt Stone Racing to fix not one, but two cars in between those very short gaps in the practice sessions. It's a lot of back slapping and hand clapping going on down there, rightfully so. But those cars are still a little bit wonky out on the racetrack. Cam Hill, he was outside the top 20. His teammate Nick Perkett back in 23rd. For the Monster Energy team, they were off the road. And James Golding getting nice and close at the top of Reed Park, up against the Amarok signage for James Golding. He spent a little bit of time at the top of the order, but got relegated down to seventh. We did see some green tyre runs at the end. But for Golding, he actually had to back out of his first lap, so needed to go for a second lap to get that. Which is probably why the sectors dropped away a little bit for him in sectors two and three. Big moment this one, the super cheap auto car found the fence on the approach to the GR dip up. Whack, that's the moment right there on the left rear. So that's going to send a pretty big shockwave through that car. Did a good job to make sure that the right side of the car was okay at least. And it's Brady Kostecki in the Chico car. Let's grab the headline at Erebus here. They're the quickest final practice before qualifying later today.